Hello, everyone, and welcome to what could possibly be a new series. A new series called mail call where we will unbox subscriber mail sent by you so as you can see in front of me we have quite a bit of subscriber mail that I've been saving up. I was originally going to do it all on a live stream, but I figured why not try and make a series out of it? Kind of like the MRE series. Um, and of course, you know, as time goes by, we can decorate this set with some of your mail. You know, pictures, uh, drawings, paintings, uh, bits and bobs, anything. We can deck it all out, make it look really cool. But, let's see. One, two, three, four, five, and six packages from viewers like you. And, of course, if you yourself would like to send subscriber mail to be unboxed, you can find my address, my P.O. Box, right there. It's P.O. Box 232, Mifflinburg, PA, 17844. Well, which one to open first? We'll start with the smallest and work our way up to the largest. Now, of course, I've blacked out all addresses and last names. So, I made sure to do that. what this could be. Let's find out. Trusty scissors.
sorry. But, um, you know, some of this mail I've been saving for, like, a couple months. Um, this is not all just one big delivery. So, just so you know. notice here. It looks like old man Lloyd's arm with a Reese's peanut butter cup. Or as old man Lloyd says, Reese's peanut butter cups. That's awesome. Sounds like Legos or something.
kind of get crushed. Thanks to the postal service. Um, this is from Derek. Thank you so much, Derek. I'll probably be able to reshape the box. And I could probably do this as a video. So, that'd be cool. I know a lot of you like Lego videos. So, should be perfect. Pretty easy to build. Fifty seven pieces, ages four and up. That'll be perfect. Okay, let's move on. This is from Joshua. So, can't wait to see what this is. It's pretty heavy. Signature stash. 
your videos helped me rest properly and I loved your creativity in your videos. I hope that your channel grows well and that you will succeed no matter what. Although I don't have money to give at this time, I am sending four old PS2 sports games that I don't use anymore as gifts for you to use for your vintage or modern video game store roleplay. As props or material to showcase. I wish nothing but the best. Sending love from Toronto. Joshua. Well, thank you so much, Joshua. And, um, you know, just like this. Um, I was saying about you know, posting things on the wall. Letters, pictures, you name it. Just have it all back here. Just fill it. That'd be cool. So, that will go on the wall. Let's see what we have here. EA Sports NHL 2005. For PlayStation 2. Well, that looks pretty fun. And eventually I'd like to get a PS2 again. You know, off of eBay or something like that. These will come in handy for two things, yeah, to play, and then of course uh, for a video game store, which, you know, once I can get myself uh, a bit of a stockpile of video games, then I will definitely use these in a video game store. MLB 2005, a baseball game. These are really cool. We have everything except for football. EA Sports NBA Live 2005. NBA 09, the inside. Cool. Well, these will definitely help, that's for sure. Because, you know, even with the video games I used to have, uh, I never really had any sports games. So, that's cool. You know, maybe even if I had like a, a, a sports related store uh, role play, I could use these. So, these will definitely come in handy and it's a perfect gift. Thank you again, Joshua. I greatly appreciate it. Now, let's move on to the next package. All right. Let's see who this is from.
is not as high. And I had to black out the uh, address. So. But, uh, it's feels somewhat heavy. Make some nice crinkly sounds. one of them because there's many different uh, types of role plays where I could have used these such as tactical role plays um, I can definitely use this for a couple role plays in my new space themed series so these will definitely come in handy real soon. And uh, what is it? The black uh, nitro exam gloves. And it says here, a gift for you. I enjoy your videos so much. I thought using black gloves for your food prep role plays would, would set them apart from your medical role plays. Good idea. Cheers, Lloyd, from Kelkins. Well, Kelkins, thank you so much. Um, I've definitely been wanting these for a while. So, thank you. Um, but yeah, that's a good idea, actually. Um, now, the with my food role plays, the typical, you know, gloves that they wear, those clear ones. Um, yeah, they are not very flexible. And they're real tight. Most of them break. They have gone through about I can't even count so many boxes of those because half the time I could have put them on and they rip. So I might start using these for that as well. So thanks again. All right. Well, let's move on to the next package. I think we have two packages left. So let's see what we got. Okay, here we have a very large package. And this is from Charles. Make some nice crinkly sounds.
read the card. It says, Dear Lloyd, I wanted to send you some fan mail I made to tell you thank you. P.S. You helped me with my artist block. Well, I am very happy to hear that I could help you with that. What I think is Charlie, a.k.a. Good Grief. Well, thank you so much, Charlie, or Good Grief. Um, I will tell you this, um, it's very unfortunate that I had to open this off camera because of the broken glass. But when I saw this, I was completely wowed. I mean, this made my day when I saw it. Um, it is a very awesome painting. And it's, uh, it's definitely going to go up there on the wall for this series, that's for sure. Well, without further ado, glass for it. Definitely, I get hung up. This is really awesome. 
I guess it's a fantastic job too. In the close up. I love it. All right. Well, we have one more package to check out. And let's do that. our final package. It's quite heavy actually. I think I got it. There we are. Okay. Well, before we take a look, what's in the package? ASMR content for a while now. It really helped me through a tough time when I was dealing with a spinal herniation a few years ago. Well, um, I'm sorry to hear that you had to go through that. But I am very happy to hear that I can, you know, help. And, you know, that's what makes making these videos worth the while is hearing stories like that. Um, and even stories that I hear about just helping people relax. You know, after a long, hard day, get to come home, chill, unwind, and relax. You know, these are the stories that I like to hear. Um, it's, it, it definitely, you know, it hits the feels, that's for sure, and keeps me going with making these videos. It, it really makes, you know, all the time, effort, money, um, stress that goes into these videos worth every single second. So I'm very glad to hear that I could help you through that time. That's awesome. Um, your videos brought me much needed peace and comfort during that period. And that's awesome. That is great. To show my gratitude, you'll find in this box a selection of some Swiss treats, which I'm sure you'll enjoy. I absolutely will. Thank you again for everything. 
Best regards from Switzerland. Patrick. Well, Patrick, thank you so much for sending me this. It's absolutely awesome. Let's see what we got. another cool postcard. That's awesome. Oh boy. Look at all this. Opa Maltine Crunchy. Uh, classic. Oh, this looks really good. Let's look at this almonds and some other kind of cool stuff in it. They can let me know. But I'll tell you this much. It's it's really cool to see this in a metal tube. Alright. Um, over here in the States, I don't really think I've uh, come across anything in a metal tube since like my great grandmother's house <laughs> back in the 80s um but no you know further back they used a lot of metal tubes for things that's really cool have these in the States. Um, but I'm sure this is better. Toblerone. These things are amazing. I guess I got a legitimate one. <laughs> Straight from the joint. Hmm. 
this is going to come up with you too. Right? They can let me know what these little guys are. Looks very interesting. amazing goodies. Now, what I'm going to do, instead of trying them right now, because uh, it'll make this a, a really long video, um, I'm going to save all of this for on Patreon and taste test it all there. So, you know, if any of you would love to see try this and find out what all this is about, then come on over and join Patreon. Um, there's all kinds of videos on there. Um, probably going to be adding some like behind the scenes type things, you know, some funny stuff, uh, things like that, but also, you know, the normal relaxing, tingly videos, too. But yeah, I'm going to save all that for uh, a video for Patreon. But, um, yeah. To everybody who uh, send me packages, so, uh, subscriber mail, thank you again so much. I greatly appreciate it. And again, if any of you would like to send anything to be unboxed and, and uh, you know, show your appreciation or, or what have you, you know, there's my P.O. box where you can send fan mail. But, uh, on there. Can't get a little 
little sloppy at times, but it's P.O. Box 232, Mifflinburg, P.A. 17844. I hope you all enjoyed the first episode and the debut of mail call. Um, I hope we can do more, but that all depends on all of you. But until next time, this is Lloyd ASMR signing off.